But I'm a man, and I can't think of any shopping expedition that could possibly take longer than that. Shoes, I've got some, I don't need any of those. I've got a chair. There's nothing I want to buy. Eventually, I bought a present for James. What about some Battenbergs, or is that too German? It is too German, isn't it? <clears throat> Sandwich spread. Potted meat! Beef spread. They must have ginger beer in Christchurch. Ginger beer's a bit racy, don't you think? No, they love it. Enid Blyton used to rub herself with it. There it is. Peruvian, Greek, Brazilian, Holland, Dutch. Grown in UK. With the shopping finished, it was time to demonstrate yet another feature of the James. Come on, come down one side of the fence or the other. Clamens lunch, Stilton or cheddar. Stilton, Stilton. or cheddar. You see? Yeah. Ginger, mate, you're talking to me. Clamens lunch is so oh, that's a bus. Why? What's what's that bit there for? Is that? Can opener, bottle opener. What a. You need a bottle opener. It's a bottle opener. It opens beer. Yes. <laughs> we want them. Is that? That's worth having, isn't it? What is it? Scrapey, scrapey, brushy, brushy. You think there's a brush? Well, OK, saw the brush off. I can't buy just one end, can I? But... There you go. See, there's just one end. Yeah, but you might as well have a brush as well. No, you don't need a brush. And then not good, but makes you look even fatter. Yeah. Jonathan Ross would never wear linen for that reason, cos he's getting quite portly. Uh, this is Chinese brocade. Chinese brocade? Yes. I don't know what that is. I don't really know what I'm doing here because I'm not very fashion conscious. Your suit's ready. Here it is. Thank you, thank you, here thank it. you. That's very it's... nice. <laughs> and so at the next station, he decided he should have one too. Correct, incorrect. Exactly. Do you agree? But I'd go even more correct. Oh, yes. Perfect. Roll it out on the desert floor. You're home. Oh, James Le Creuset. See, Hammond would hate this because this weighs more than a tent in his mind, <laughs> which it does, actually. <laughs> a lot <laughs> more. And it weighs more because it is a quality item. Exactly. Pocket trowel. Pocket soap. Here we go. Pasta spoon. Yeah, good idea. I find that bottle opener a bit lightweight. Yeah, more expensive is what we're looking for. See, yeah. look at this, James. This is the sort of thing Hammond would think is a chair. Ooh, that's all you need. That's your whole stove. That's it. It's a gas, too, isn't it? I presume so. Well, I mean, for two, you could get a small chicken in there or a pheasant. We're getting there now. So that folds down to that. Yeah. Morning, shoppers. To be fair, this is a very big shopping centre. It's This is easier than walking. It's miles. Ooh, that reminds me. I need to get cat food. Unfortunately, I couldn't find the pet shop, so it was time to leave. Can I have cotton chips 75 times? And in the shop, we found a bit more than Kit Kats and pies. Oh, wait a minute. Caramelised cocaine. Now, that's something you don't see in every motorway service station. Wow. You take it and then you talk for hours. Let's have that. In fact, the sweet is made from coca leaves, which are legal and used by locals to ward off the effects of altitude sickness. Look, Hammond found them very Moorish. Earrings. They just. Uh, I don't think earrings are right. Do you know what myrrh is? Myrrh. myrrh, myrrh, what, myrrh. Gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Yeah, no, I, don't I don't know either. Do you have frankincense? Frankies? Frankincense. No. No. OK. Ah, have you got myrrh on it? No, you've got Calvin Klein, yes. Hugo, Boss, but no myrrh. Mm. Quite expensive. 
Buenas tardes. Uh, ¿Tiene una carretilla? The man says this isn't real grass, it's synthetic. You'd never know. Davashi Nogi. Davashi Nogi. What are, you, what are you saying? I'm trying to find you some food that isn't fish. Oh, thank you. Is this a marrow? Fuck. This is one. Fuck. A... This is... Like it, is it? Right. Well, I thought it was a marrow. Than European people haggling in places like this, because they're haggling over a dollar. It doesn't matter to you. It doesn't matter, and it matters a lot to them. <laughs> Just pay the price. Yeah. How much? 75. How? I was thinking 25. Having stocked up on luxury goods, we went in search of some more practical items. Oh, hello. Cooking, cooking. Yes. Something for getting rid of flies. Yeah. Fly. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Taser. <laughs> I don't like any of that. I won't like those. Certainly won't like that. I went to buy some more dead fish. HIV, you're sick. HIV, what? Uh, I may not get out of the car. Chaz and Dave, Malta Populare, Inglesi, uh, I don't Pop understand. The hotel room I ever stayed in was in South Beach in Miami. And what I'm going to try and do is replicate the decor there in the back of my beamer. Morning. Do you have any white cotton? Oh. And it's got a cockerel on it. Yeah. I'll have one of them and the kettle. Thank you. Your nails? Yeah. Deal. <laughs> there we go. And this is half inch. Perfect. That's quite a lot, isn't it? That's more than I expect. I didn't think it was this long, I'll be honest. Gorgonzola here. Gorgonzola? Gorgonzola. I'll go and check for you. Thanks. I don't mean gorgonzola, do I? That's a cheese. That's bougainvillea, I meant. So what's alive that I could have? You want there's, no point, there's no point paying for daffodils. You're just going to nick those from a roundabout. No, I'm looking Hanging for something buses. for a garden, a rower's garden. Right. I've been okay. sent to get plants, but I just don't know. Other than gorgonzola, no, uh, what's it called? Gonorrhea. Things have gone literally I've hit the luxury toilet tissue. And some bread. Yes, I just hit some. Oh, oh no! I've got fifteen biscuits literally everywhere. He's got too much power. I've got 120 horsepower in this. You don't want any more than that on Marvel. Bears. The handbrake. 